So just to show you the uh, headlights have got uh, these HID properties with the headlight wash. There are the front parking sensors, which there are two of, you can switch them on and off. And the front fog lights are all working nicely. To show you at the back here, we've got these new style LED rear lights, so again, a nice modern look to this car. Okay, so C-Max Titanium. Diesel, 1.8 TDCI, 115 brake with ABS, ABS brakes, lots of airbags, flop and fold rear seats, perfect headlining, picnic tables in the rear, map pockets in the rear, all these seats, again have a little bit of soiling to them but not too bad at all, if you've got a dog or lots of kids it's not going to make any odds to you whatsoever, if you want it fully valeted it'll cost you about 30 quid at the local Polish, Polish but we've given it an intermediate type of clean and as you can see great big storage bins 12 volt power supplies dotted everywhere on this car and also these rather smart sun blinds has it got extra tinted to the glass i think there's tintedness but not excessive moving up front then so door cards have all got a little bit of wear on these uh handles due to the fact that uh, it's just had a silver finish and it's gone back to black probably pick that off and have it all black the driver's seat is in pretty good order there's a nice uh, decent driver's seat there no rips tears pedal rubbers are in good order so are the full mats center armrest lumbar supports on both seats auxiliary input on the uh, for the CD player in there another 12 volt power supply cup holders five-speed manual lots of airbags slotted around a good six I would imagine the air conditioning works you put the aircon on and it blows nice and cold and you can hear the compressor click in. It has a phone, it has some phone buttons here, whether they're working I'm not sure. Uh, I haven't collected up a phone, whether it's got a Bluetooth system I don't know either, but uh, it certainly um, has a six disc changer built into here and it has radio features and it does say phone there, it just says audio muted, maybe it's not got it paired up. And also a fingertip controlled hi-fi system here. The car's idling over perfectly at uh, 800 RPM temperature gauge working, fuel for gauge working, and the RPM, uh, well, as I say, lips up quite nicely, nice and responsive. Leather steering wheel, auto wipers on, auto lights d d uh, on the rear view mirror, nice little mirror up here for keeping an eye on your children. Three button remote control with two keys, auto lights on as well, four electric windows and electric mirrors. Big cubby storage hol holder up here as well. That aircon's blowing lovely and cold, that's coming through beautifully. All the books and owner's manuals are in there along with the locking wheel nut and that's the original, that's the uh, replacement tax disc which showed the private registration number as R5BRR which you'll see is the initials of the previous keeper I think. Or is it? No, nope, it doesn't look like it. <laughs> Jonathan Mark Ratcliffe. Maybe I'll be something to do with him but uh, it was on the car. And it's been taken off now and back to its original 07 plate. So the clutch pedal, well the clutch pedal feels nice it's lightish and it's got a great biting point you're not going to need to replace the clutch on that in the near future we've got a little menu button here the parking sensors all work fine you can turn them on and off there we go trip computer here 131 819 miles driver's door open outside air temperature average speed instant fuel average fuel consumption etc etc so yeah with a little bit of wear in the car but a lovely drive good responsive 115 brake horsepower motor i think we're talking about a nice bit of kit there extremely usable for a small family in slightly upright driving position and according to uh the reviews i've read there isn't much in the way of a better driving position in anything so we'll leave you with that shot thank you very much for watching and we'll speak to you soon Bye bye